It's postseason time for high school wrestling as we begin with the Naperville Central Regional. Four of our area teams are in attendance, including the host Red Hawks, who come in as your defending regional champs. While everyone looks to punch their ticket to sectionals, the Marmion Cadets have a wrestler in every championship match and look to capture their ninth regional plaque since 2010. We begin with the third place match at 113 pounds. Naperville Central's Ty Martin takes care of Naperville North's Zach Valley in a 9-5 decision and is heading to sectionals after a third place finish. Championship at 126 pounds has Red Hawk Ethan Olsen in a tough one with Marmion's Christian Fabia. Olsen is able to keep control on his opponent throughout the match, winning it 9-3 and is your regional champion at 126. Now the cadets hit the gas pedal at 138. Santino Scolaro is able to bull ride his way on Central's Tommy Porter. No mercy is shown at all in this match as Scolaro takes first place with a 9-2 win. We have overtime in the 145-pound championship match. Naperville North's Cameron Clark turns over Marmion's Tegan Chumbly on his back, and that's all he needed to seal the deal, and it's off to sectionals for the Husky. You can tell he's all fired up. Championship at 152 has NC's Aiden Lutz back from an injury, but cadet Colin Kerrigan gives him a brutal welcome. It's a low-scoring affair in this match, but Kerrigan does enough to win the regional title and hand Lutz his first loss of the season. We got a good one at 160. It's Antonio Torres from Wabonzi facing former Matia Valley Mustang Kenny Sawicki, this time rocking the Marmee in blue. Each wrestler gets some fast points early on, but it's Torres who gets the last lap. He locks Sawicki on his back and holds him long enough for the pin and is your 160-pound champion. However, the cadets show why they have eight regional titles. Tyler Perry gets aggressive on Central's Tristan Hall, and that results in a quick pin in the 170-pound championship. Same go around at 220. Sean Sheck takes care of Obanzi's Jacob Halsire and is one of 10 cadets winning a championship match. Naperville Central does get some help in the heavyweight third place match with Nico Epps beating Wabonzi's Luke Funton in overtime. Although at the end of the day, it's Marmion winning the regional title with West Aurora in second and Naperville Central in third. It felt good. I mean, teams came together a lot. We've improved a lot over the season. We had a couple tough, we couple tough weeks, but uh, got the job done. It feels awesome to win the regional because freshman year, uh, what I took third, I choked uh, to a guy I lost to. But no, it feels really good. Like, I didn't think I was even going to win that match, but I pushed the pace and came out hard. I got a little too excited with trying to, he was, I think I had opportunity to pin him. I got too excited, wasn't in a great position. He reversed me, then I reversed that shortly after that. And then after that, rode him out a little bit, locked up the cradle, stacked up and pinned him. Just the great competition we got going on. I'm going to see some good guys, some good competition. That's what I would like to see right before state.